Hello, everybody. How are you doing today? My name is Tony Rizzano, and this is episode 333 of the world famous, the university love, the best podcast in one, two, three galaxies. But ladies and gentlemen, you and I, we just call it online marketing moves, and we are coming to you live today. Today is July the 14th, 2021. Ladies and gentlemen, how are you doing today? Okay. Now, <clears throat> Today, this episode, it's not about any strategies, it's not about any marketing, it's not about any motivation. This episode is just about me, it's just about you, it's about our freedoms, it's about our liberties, it's about justice, it's about, you know, the pursuit of taking care of yourself now. Why do I bring this up? Ladies and gentlemen, reading, you know, I went to the store yesterday, I went to Walmart, and of course, I went to a Walmart, and they said, no, you know, I went to the self-checkout line, and they said, all the, all the machines said, no, no cash, you know, no cash accepted, card only. You know, I went to the gas station yesterday to use cash and they said, we don't have any coins. We have to give you back a receipt. They said they gave me a little gift card of 65 cents and they claim that they don't have any coin. There's a coin shortage again. You know, I thought this was done last year and now, you know, the inflation is on the rise and, you know, the gas prices are up, you know, <clears throat> and, um, well, the gas prices have been like two eighty nine, two two eighty seven. They haven't really went down here where I live, and it just got me to thinking. And it's it's like, you know, of course, as you well know, and like I I don't know if, if I ever told you before, but I used to, you know, be one of these people. I would get mad at the job because they wasn't paying me enough and all this, you know. But I had to change my I had to change my reality. The re- the reality of the situation is. is the job is gonna pay you what they're gonna pay you, you know. It's, that's 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 not that's not up to them to take care of me and you know my family. It's up to me to do that, you know. And I got to thinking. So this is one of the reasons why you know started the whole online, you know, you know, hey, I'm gonna be you know online marketing, create a business for myself, you know, so I can dictate the money that I want to make. And I highly suggest you know. <clears throat> that you do the same. I don't I don't care what you do, but you have to do something. You because the days of working for somebody for 30 years and them taking care of you, th- those days are far far in between, you know. Those days are long gone. The people that make all the decisions, the people in Congress, well, especially, you know, here in America, I don't know if in different countries how this works, but these people they work, they'll be in Congress for a long time probably. And then, you know, they get kickbacks, they get pensions, they get all this stuff, you know, from the government, you know, but the ordinary citizens, you know, we are going to, you know, eventually I'm 42, you know, and te- in, qu- in quotation marks, I'll, I can be, I, I'll be able to retire in 23 years, you know, but by then, what's going to be a social security? Who knows, you know, but do I want to, why do I want to change my lifestyle when I'm 65? And go from making how much I make now to making, you know, like 70% less probably of that, you know. Yeah, you have some money saved up and everything, but how long is that going to last? You know, how long are you going to live? You might live till you're 105. You might live till you're 100. You never know. And then what's going to happen, you know. So I take this opportunity to say to, in today's episode, don't rely on the government. Don't rely on jobs. Don't rely on anybody but yourself when it comes to, you know, putting putting yourself, you know, getting control of your life, getting control of your finances, you know, making sure that you won't have to worry about inflation. You want to worry about this. You want to worry about that, you know, and double down your actions, double down, double down on your business, you know, work, work twice as hard, you know, as far as because. You know, people are going to whine and people are going to say, oh, nobody's buying, you know, but there's always money to be found, 
you know, during times of recession, during times of, you know, depression, all there's all there's so many stories about people getting rich from in the depression. There's so many stories about people getting rich during, you know, bad economic times. So that doesn't mean there's gonna be no money, you know. And a lot of people have the mentality of, oh, nobody's buying, so why should I sell them? No, you know, you you double down, you do more, you know. You work harder at your let's say you lose a job work harder at this business than you do your job and you will see the reward you know you will reap the benefits <clears throat> so and, and i don't know about you but in this country i think me myself i, I don't really want to deal with the government i don't want to really have to depend on the government for much because you know time and time again they have proven to uh let the american people down so you know it doesn't matter democrat republican to me they're all about the same you know i'm more of a independent you know you can't because even though republicans republicans are for business and all that kind of stuff and it's great you know so they 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 won't tax like rich but you know i'm a small business you know you you you're a small business you know no who knows what they're going to do, you know, and Democrats, they are going to help out the extremely poor, but they don't want you to. They also do not want like small businesses. They, they'll tax the hell off a of small business, too. You know what I mean? So it's like either side, it doesn't matter. Both of them have their, you know, sketchy sides about them, you know. But so, you know, I wouldn't, you know, I know a lot of people are into politics here in America, and they're like Democrats are great, Republicans are great, and eh, they're both both of them are shady if you ask me. But anyway, so you can't rely on that. You can't rely on you know your neighbor. You can't rely on you know the person down the street. You can't rely on your mother, your brother, your sister. You know you have to rely on you. So when you figure that part out, you will start working. You will start you know you will figure out what you want to do. You will figure out make some money, store store the money away. You know store some money away. Keep some money set aside for a rainy day. You never know. And um, yeah, that's it. Just rely on you, you know? Like, be, because right, right now they're like, oh, inflation, inflation. And it's like, inflation. Like, you know, they say one thing and then, you know, they're like, oh, when the, when the vaccine, when they roll out the vaccine, people will be out and then the economy will be back up and running. You know, now they like, Oh, inflation, this, that, and the other, you know. And you can never trust the news because the news doesn't matter what news outlet you go to. All of them are full of all of them are full of you know what, you know. So it's just it's getting worse and worse. And you know, I'm just like I told my wife, I'm like, we, we had to we had we have to take care of each other. We have to make sure that we are you know running our businesses you know full bloom, full steam ahead. And, you know, make sure that we are making making the most money we can make and doing the things that we need to do to put ourselves in a position where we don't have to worry about the government. We don't have to worry about jobs. We don't have to worry about anything. You know, we, we want to cover everything ourselves, you know, so that's where we're at. And I hope you, I don't know if you feel the same way, but you know, I highly suggest that you, you know, get to the point where, you know, I'm not saying, you know, like I said, Hey, job a job is great a job is good you know nothing wrong with a job but don't get upset when the job is not paying you what you think you should make you know go out go out go out and get what get what you are worth what you feel that you are worth you know go out and get it yourself you know either you know get better at get better skills or you know create something for yourself or do something to that that way you can position yourself so you can make all the monies you want all right and of course save some for a rainy day because you never know all right but ladies and gentlemen don't be relying on the government don't be relying on jobs don't be relying on people don't be relying on outside entities you know focus on you you get better and everything else will get better all right but ladies and gentlemen, that's it. We will be back tomorrow with all new episodes. Ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow is the one year anniversary that we started this podcast and we said we're not going to stop. And we have, you know, 300 and something, 40 episodes in the can. It's been great. So this tomorrow we will look back a little bit, but we also will do a new episode of the podcast. But until then, 
My name is Tony Rizzano. Take care of yourselves. And as always, everybody, peace.